Hi, my name is Ochiame Kwame, the rap doctor, and I'm your host for today's program. And I'm in the house of a man who needs no introduction. Hello, Mr. Versatile, you're welcome to the show. Thank you. Okay, you and Anama McBrown were the most talked about celebrity couple in, in Ghana when you were dating. How did this affect your career? In a very, it affected my career in a very positive way because um, Mac Brown, as you know, is very giving, very forthcoming. Really? She is very um, human. And uh, I remember when I met her, I was really broke. And she provided an opportunity for me to tap into her brand. She was the most popular female actress in Ghana by then. And it gave me an opportunity for my solo project to hit because she was the woman um, force behind me around that time and um, so I'll say that yes it affected my career in a very very positive way Wow but she broke your heart <laughs> <laughs> you've been branded as a family man but doesn't that rather give you more attention from the ladies oh yes I think it does because <laughs> it does it does straightforward because the ladies need an example uh, you know uh, uh, a young trendy, artistic, intelligent guy who <laughs> will treat them nice. Wow. Um, I, I seem to provide that hope for them. So uh, basically for progressive age group of women, they find it really attractive and I'm really pampered. Okay, now you tell me, what is the most a female fan has been willing to do to catch your attention? Hey, I've had a uh, lot. I've had women sneaking into my hotel rooms. Wow. Um, with see-through night, um, hey, my wife will be offended. She doesn't like me to talk about this one. Um, women sneaking <laughs> <laughs> hotel rooms in see-through um, nighties. I've had um, women, you know, I like voluptuous women. And so women writing in my <laughs> inbox on Facebook, I really have to send this and that and um, dropping their numbers. I've had um, I've had a lot, but um, fortunately, most of my female fans are really, really discerning. So um, they admire me. They admire me at day. They, they know. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Uh, the truth. What have you done career-wise that you wish you could undo? That I wish I could undo. Um, career-wise, yes. Playing this song, Washao Kawakura, Abramian Tina, Fisa Krum, Haobiri, Obim Pena. Yes, that song was really bad. It was I think I was sick in the head when I was writing that chorus. <laughs> Plus, I didn't understand what love was. I was only 21 when I wrote that. And then I sometimes I I I, I pray. I know that it really had maybe it had a, a, a bad influence on married couple. And I'm sorry. <laughs> I, I don't think I could ever go that line again because if yeah, it's, it's bad. This is from the streets. Some of your hardcore fans still have not forgiven you for not replying or bravo. What do you tell these people? I'll tell them that any day nothing would have made me happier than to go into a studio and drop lies about his height and how he can't evolve but it, it will break my heart that his fans will stop loving me and some of my fans who do not want me to to drop a song about one person if it's not in chroma or rollins or kufo would also leave me so it's really about business and they shouldn't worry one day I'll put him in his place. <laughs> mm. I think you should give it to him one time. <laughs> this is the segment I like most, where you find out who is real and who is not. The truth and their segment. So, tell the truth. Half quad, dark skin. Dark skin. Slim or chubby? None of that. <laughs> I want the waist to be like a wasp 
and her hips like an elephant. <laughs> Slim <laughs> and chubby. How old were you when you lost your virginity? After six form, that would be 95. I was born in 76. Do the maths. Where did you lose your virginity? I'm not telling you. <laughs> what was your nickname at school? Whiskey. Really? Before the fake Nigerian Whiskey? Have you ever been intimate with someone from a different country? Yes. Honestly, I think I've done every continent. <laughs> <laughs> What part of your body do you hate most? I, I hate my nose when I'm doing interviews because this place has more oil than the Western region. First impressions. Whatever I say, you say the first thing that comes to mind. Short. Abrafo. <laughs> He'll come and get you again. Oh. Wild. Miss Bell. Party. Kwamfache. Old. Andy Dusty, Azonto, Gasmela, beautiful, my wife, one love, Kubolo, Raquel. <laughs> <laughs> Catch you next time when I get the opportunity to come and talk to this smart guy again. My name is Shavikwam, the rap doctor, and thank you for watching the Dear Diaries. It's all truth.